Still We Rise applies to Glide every day. It's a theme about the work we do to help people find their way through the challenges that they face in their lives. It might be loneliness, marginalization, discrimination, injustice. We help them find their voice, we help them tell their story, and we help them get out the other end of this tunnel where there is light. There's a story that comes from the streets, whether that's the streets of Marin, where there is privilege, or the streets of Ellis Street, where there is poverty. You know, there is a story, a song, a cadence, a poem that comes from all of the places. How do we get people to rise up and at the same time tell their story? You may write me down in history with your bitter, twisted lies. You may trod me in the very dirt, but still like dust, I'll arrive. At Glide, every voice has so much value. It is a way in which we can begin to define ourselves. And you can see yourself in this person or that person or that person, and it doesn't matter if they're using drugs and you're not. It doesn't matter if they've been abused and you have not. What you see is a human being. Out of the huts of history's shame, I rise. Up from a past rooted in pain, I rise. I'm a black ocean leaping and wide, welling and swelling, I bear in the tide. The racialized violence that we're in and out of, the rates of poverty and addiction and dying from, from drug overdoses, and now COVID. This is a crucible moment. History is going to ask you, what were you doing when black folks were being killed by the police? What were you doing when women's rights were being taken away from them? What were you doing when the homeless encampments grew around the world? This moment is going to produce the next generation of leaders. Part of what Glide does is build empathy. We bring people together from all walks of life into one community. We're training police, we're training district attorneys, we're training doctors and nurses, and we're working with them to really understand the challenges in the city, to understand each other, and ultimately to make a shift in their hearts and their minds, hoping that they will go back into their institutions and make change there, and it's already working. Through cycles of addiction and coming into recovery, still we rise. Through homelessness and houselessness and joblessness, still we rise. From facing your privilege and how to deploy it in service of this world that's suffering, still we rise. Bringing the gifts that my ancestors gave, I am the hope and the dream of the slave. I rise. I'll rise. I rise. For generations to come, we will be welcoming people into our home, into our community, with open arms, with love, so that they may rise, so that they may transform their lives. <laughs>